I am just a normal country girl from Ibaraki, Japan. Currently, I pet sit, babysit, and work as an English teacher for local kids. What I want to say is that becoming Miss Japan is an opportunity for everyone, not only for certain people. When I was younger, I never really had a dream for myself, as there was lack of representation while I was growing up. Lack of representation really affected my mental well being. As a child, I also experienced a lot of bullying. I was excluded as a girl by my schoolmates because my parents are immigrants and I am considered an outsider in my countryside community. During my childhood, I was teased and told all kinds of abusive words about my appearance that made me feel unworthy of becoming Miss Japan. Because of being bullied in my childhood, I left Japan and I traveled around 25 countries as a solo backpacker during my teenage years. And I attend college in the States. When people leave their home country, they frequently have opportunities to explain their heritage. When I do, I always speak about myself as a Japanese girl. It is more natural for me because my morals, habits, and lifestyle are all aligned with Japanese ideas. Also, in my college world history class, I always chose to write essays comparing the topics with Japanese history, and I received all A's. However, as soon as I came back to Japan, others saw me as a foreigner. I honestly still think of myself as not a typical Japanese person sometimes, especially when I am in my home in the countryside. It feels tragic that I can only comfortably say I am Japanese when I am out of Japan. Someone I really look up to told me that for Miss Grand International, they appoint people from a wide variety of backgrounds, including second generation immigrants. Maraming salamat po sa mga nanonood. Sana sabay-bayan niya po ako dahil half Filipina po ako and I love Philippines. And I will send my love to all of my supporters. Since my childhood trauma, I've been trying every day to find out who I am. I did actually not find myself floating on the Caribbean Sea, climbing up to Machu Picchu, fighting as a warrior at the Colosseum, or neither dancing at the bar counter. But after journeying all the way around the world to figure out, I realized that where I truly am is inside of me, in my heart, not where I am in the world geographically. The truth is life is not about finding yourself. Life is about creating yourself. Nobody succeeds easily without dedication and strong perseverance. The most important thing to do is to focus on the present moment and consistently work towards your goals. To all second generation immigrants in Japan, nothing in the past defines you. Your future is yours to decide and we can create who we want to be now.